Where the chalky blue of the Pacific Ocean meets the arid landscapes of Peru, there is a wildlife-rich region that is home to some of the most spectacular seabird colonies on the planet. Looking skyward from a zodiac, I was overwhelmed by the airborne highways that surrounded me. Seemingly perfect chaos as the flocks wove through one another en route to and from their colonies ashore. When we landed on the coastal island of Lobos de Tierra, we were greeted by the inquisitive stare of the blue-footed booby, a name given to them by the Spanish conquistadors, Bobo, meaning foolish and clown-like, a fitting name for these large-footed, awkward, and unsuspecting birds. As I began to peer at them through my camera, it was this unsuspecting nature that made documenting these birds so memorable. They were unfazed by my presence as I moved freely around them, so I was able to capture the intimacies of their mating rituals without causing disturbance. The male's loud whistling calls break the ice. Once he's caught her interest, he begins a distinctive strut to show off his proudest assets, his fantastic blue feet. The healthier he is, the bluer his feet will be, so they're a good sign that he'll be a capable fisher to provide for their potential brood. He finishes his routine with a dance, continuing to whistle while pointing his beak, tail and wingtips elegantly into the sky, exaggerating the features of his beautiful body and proving that he is the bird for her. The coast of Peru is home to just a few bird species but what makes it so unique is that it offers the chance to document them in such colossal numbers and in great detail. This is a rich coastal environment of salt water, desert sands and feathers. <laughs>